July 24th, 2011 in Buenos Aires saw the Copa America final between Uruguay and Paraguay. Now Paraguay were going for their third title while Uruguay fresh off coming top four in the last World Cup were aiming to win their record 15th title. You really get to see Luis Suarez here at his absolute peak. He drove Paraguay crazy all match and I really think this is one of his all-time best performances with Uruguay. Early on, there was actually a key moment when Diego Lugano's header was actually handed off the goal line by a Paraguayan defender. Though amidst the chaos, this was not seen by the referee. From this point on, just have a look at Luis Suarez acting like a one-man wrecking crew. The Estadio Monumental in Buenos Aires, which was packed with traveling Uruguayans, exploded in jubilation as Uruguay took the lead in the final. One of the key players in this Uruguay side was Diego El Russo Perez, who was physically at his peak during this era. La Celeste nearly went 2-0 up thanks to a great through ball from Suarez to Forlan. Uruguay were ravenously trying everything to score the second goal, which consistently eluded them in the first half. At one point, Diego Forlan even attempted a similar goal to the one he scored against Germany in the third place match of the 2010 World Cup. Finally, the high pressure worked as Arevalo Rios intercepted a key ball. <laughs> So this goal was vindication or further vindication for Forlan, who had been easily one of the best players of the tournament so far. If anything got through their first line of defense, players like Diego Perez were there to clean things up. If not El Russo, then you had players like Captain Diego Lugano ready to step in. In the second half, there was a big moment when Paraguay had a very clear chance. Nelson Valdez struck a goal-bound volley, which was narrowly saved by Fernando Muslera. At this point, Edinson Cavani, who had been injured most of the tournament, created a very clear chance. As the match was coming to an end, Diego Godin was subbed on to help withstand Paraguay's last attacks. His inclusion was very timely as it led to an iconic counterattack involving Suarez, Cavani, and Forlan. With the score at 3-0, the referee blew the whistle as Uruguay became South American champions for the record 15th time in front of a boisterous Estadio Monumental. The second time that La Celeste had won the trophy in this stadium. In terms of awards, Justo Villar won goalkeeper of the tournament, Sebastián Cuartes won best a young player of the Copa America, Diego Lugano quite humorously won the Fair Play Award, and Luis Suarez won player of the tournament, beating out Neymar, Messi, and peak Radamel Falcao. The celebrations began in Buenos Aires, but actually continued that night across the border as the players traveled to Montevideo where they were greeted by the Estadio Centenario despite it being a very cold night. Their fans and players together celebrated this historic feat. Thank you for watching.